everyone, it's Stacy. Thanks for stopping by. And if this is your first time, I want to say thank you. And if you like this video, please give me a thumbs up and like it and subscribe. And if you are a new subscriber, I want to say thank you. And today I'm going to talk about some of the things that I have purchased for my Hawaii trip that I'm so excited to be going on. Um, and um, I'm not gonna go over all the clothes and everything, just a few things that I wanted to show you that it's gonna just help make my life easier. And um, the first thing I wanna talk about is, um, you know how everybody's been wearing like sundresses or denim skirts and stuff with kids? And um, I love that look, I think it's so cute cute and sexy and I, I just think that's adorable but my problem is is those kid sneakers are totally flat there is no arch support or whatever yeah if you're young and don't have any foot problems I've had um, bunion surgery then they have fused bones in my foot they put a plate so I have a lot of foot issues so shoes haven't been my best friend for the last couple of years but I found these and these are called grasshoppers and they are I got them at DSW uh, they're called the Jenny Jenny white but I want to show you what they look like they're actually like old lady orthopedic sneakers but look they look just like a kid I mean, if you were just looking at it like that, right? Looks like a kid. So, but what happened inside, it has really good um, arch support and it's called uh, um, Orthrolite. And they are really light and they're comfortable. I'm so excited. And they were only like $34.99. And I actually <laughs> bought these when I, when I used a $10 coupon off. But, um, I got them at DSW, but I also seen them online at Kohl's, I think, and Belks or something else. But there, another important fact, and when you, whenever you go away, you get so excited about going away and you want to buy a bunch of things, you know? And then you get somewhere, and then I know when we went to Paris, we were walking 14 miles a day. It was crazy. Um, so I know we'll be doing a lot of walking, but the main thing about when you buy any type of shoes this is a really good tip. You, you need to buy them at least two to three weeks before you're gonna go on your trip and you have to start wearing them because you, you're gonna break, be able to break them in. You're gonna be able to know, am I gonna be able to walk long distances in this? I know when I went to Paris, I, I went and I bought myself a few shoes and I tried doing that and I couldn't, the shoes were not good. I ended up just taking one of my old, just plain black ballet flats and that's what I use. So I've been wearing these, getting some wear into these babies, and these are perfect. So if you are old ladyish, um, like me, only in number, not in mind, or have some feet problems, feet issues, try these out. I think you'll really like them. I can't wait to wear them. Then, I live in Florida. I never go to the beach. Um, I, I don't have a pool, so um, I want a pool, that's going to come, but I have not bought a bathing suit, no exaggeration, I've been in Florida here for over 20 years, I haven't bought a bathing suit in 5-7 years, because I hate bathing suit shopping, ladies can I get an amen, it's like, it's like the most depressing thing in the world sometimes. I mean, I had just come off of some medicine, I call it the demon drug, the prednisone, the doctor made me go on. He knows I hate going on that. And it's like, if I take the first pill, it's like I gained 10 pounds like that. So I had a little extra weight on my five foot two frame. So that makes shopping even more depressing. So I finally today got a bathing suit and Really, I mean, I know people like go to um, a warm tropical place on vacation. They've got like 12 suits. Uh-uh, I got one now. <laughs> so maybe I might buy it. But I was able to find this one. And, you know, bathing suits are expensive. Oh, my God. I was like $100 for a bathing suit. Well, this one I, I ended up finally finding in Dillard's. But I found this brand, um, La Blanca, at a couple of other places. And um, it actually was 119. I could choke. 
but I've tried on everything. I went to Target, tried on all those, and you know, it's like these bathing suits are made for, I call them like teeny boppers or people that are really, really skinny. And so I found this one, I ended up, I, I tried it on, my husband was like, yeah, I like that one. So we're gonna keep, we're gonna keep this one. And it's a one piece and I'm just gonna be wearing the cover up anyway. <laughs> so um, I finally got that just today and it's off the list. So thank God for that. And then I love traveling with a backpack. This is my Henry Bendel and I use a backpack and what I do is instead of um, this, so this is one of my carry-ons and I, what I do is I, I love this backpack, isn't it beautiful? I know um, a Busby style, Erin has this one. I remember her talking about it and I had already gotten mine. I was like, yay, she's got the same one, but she's got it in um, black. And I think Melissa has this one also, Melissa 50, 55. And I love it. It is so convenient and you can, you can carry it like this as a regular purse or use the backpack. And so what I like to do is, because it's so heavy that I'm not going to be using, I'm mostly using this for the traveling, what I do is I get myself a little like uh, clutch, like a wallet on a chain, and I got this at Francis, Francesca's, and you know it has the spots that you can put your cards and stuff. So I use this inside of this as my wallet so I can easily just pull that out and put it across body if I want to and then at night um, if I go out to dinner or whatever then I have my cute little my cute little nighttime purse you know and then it's cross body if I want or I can get rid of the chain and it's like it's perfect so I don't have to be you know have have to carry this big bag I can use this so I really like these two, so that's gonna make my life a little bit easier. Another thing I found was this. I've been thinking, you know, I don't wanna take my flat iron and my curling iron. Oh, by the way, I don't know if you noticed, like I cut a lot off and I went a little bit darker. And um, with my hair, that's my hair. So I found this on Amazon and I don't know, I don't even know the name of it. I'm gonna link everything below if I can find the links for them. There's no actual no name on it at all. So it comes in a nice little zippered pouch and you know, for protection if you're putting it away hot. But check this out. It's a flat iron and curling iron all in one. I know. So if you wanna use it as a curling iron, you use it like that, right? If you wanna use it as a flat iron on the back here is a lock and an unlock you open it and then it becomes a flat iron. Oh, brilliant. I wish I thought of this. I mean, I did think about it. That's why I was looking for something like this, but I found it on Amazon and it was, I think like, I'm thinking like a 29 or something like that. But I'm telling you, I used it to make sure because I didn't want to go there and then it, it didn't work um, and works perfectly. Look at, so compact. So that's all taken care of. And then another thing is, is I hate when you go to the beach and I'm 54 and I can't see squat anymore. And if I don't have my, my glasses on, I can't read. And I wonder if I'm gonna go to the beach and I wanna read, I wanna be able to read. And I can't put my glasses over my sunglasses and I don't have prescription sunglasses. I only have regular um, eyeglasses. Um, I have to get them one day. But I found these at Steinmart. And you know, they're, they're the sunglasses with the readers on it. I used to have a pair a long time ago. So now I can look pretty decent with these on and not like, you know, some of the ones they sell that look too old granny, even though I am a granny. And I can read and still have sun protection. So I thought they were really great. I mean, they almost kind of kind of look very stylish, but um, <laughs> so these will be my beach ones. And then I, I found this little case and I thought it was cute too. So I think these were like $15 and the case was like $8 or something. So I have that. So that takes care of the beach. And then today I found this and I said, that little purse, the little red one, the wallet on the chain, chain isn't 
great for during the day when you're sightseeing and stuff. So I really wanted a crossbody bag, not um, so I don't have to carry too small or too big. So I found this Michael Kors. I don't have it. I have one bag from Michael Kors uh, crossbody with the adjustable. And I always have to get the adjustable because sometimes they're, they're too long or it's just not right. So I got the adjustable and it's like a almost like a um, water resistant material and so I like that so it won't get stained. It has a cute little front pocket and then on the inside it has plenty enough room if I wanted to put a camera lens in there or I could put my sunglasses and reading glasses in there um, very comfortably and still have a lot more room and I found it at this unbelievable price. So it was over a hundred dollars and it re was reduced to 89. Then it was 64 and then I got another 10% off. Score! So, um, so it's nice. It's a nice crossbody bag that I could wear and it's kind of summery, like Hawaii. So um, I'm really happy with that purchase. So those are some of the things I'm taking to Hawaii to make my life easier. And uh, if you have any other suggestion or packing tips, please let me know in the comments below. I'd love to know. But I am in the process of editing all the things I have on my spare room bed right now. So they are all going in a suitcase tomorrow. So um, I'm excited and like I said, I'm gonna try to do the vlogging and we're gonna, um, my husband's got the GoPros and we've got some more um, lenses and um, all that stuff that he wants to do when we're skydiving and zip lining. So it should be fun and um, follow me on Snapchat for uh, you know minute to minute vlogging, but um, we'll be putting together some good videos. That's what we plan to do. So you could see how much fun we had on the trip that we waited a very long time to go on. So thanks again for watching and don't forget, you were born to be a blessing. Have a great day. Bye-bye.